duck season has been over for a while and it's driving me crazy. So I pulled out my air rifle that I've had for, I don't know, maybe a, two years or so. I've never actually shot it until yesterday. I've been target practicing right here. So I was sighting it in um, and it's about 25 yards where I was shooting from. So I feel like I'm getting better groups. So duck season might be over, but hunting season is not. So I'm gonna set up my decoy by this tree because the doves seem to really like this tree. The cool thing about that is, ooh. So I'm just gonna sit on the windowsill right here. Perfect view of the tree. All right, let's just like, oh. You ever hunted without shoes on, just in your socks? Yeah, me neither, but we're doing it today. Yeah, yeah. I hope my neighbors like don't call the police or something. Like there's a weirdo with a rifle hanging out his window. Well, my neighbors can't think it's that strange because I have a neighbor that walks a pig like a dog. I have another neighbor that walks a chicken. So to me, that's a little weird. Shouldn't walk what you eat, just saying. All right, I've been sitting here for a while and this is just not comfortable, so. I'm thinking, why the heck am I sitting on that uncomfortable windowsill when I have a bed right here? It's much better. Okay, a dove just landed. It did not land in the tree. It landed behind the tree. Dang it. Just flew over to the neighbor's house. All right, so I cannot get anything to land in that tree, so I have to try again a different day. All right, it's a different day, I'm switching it up. This time I moved the mojo into this tree that is next to the big tree I'm trying to get him to land on. I've got some other decoys here too. Got one there and another one there and right here. So I got four decoys this time, and I'm hunting in the morning. I mostly see the doves here in the morning, and I've been trying to hunt them in the evening. So I think hunting in the morning, I'm gonna have a better chance of getting something. But I'm not only going for those collared doves, I'm going for pigeons, magpies, sparrows, starlings, you know, those uh, invasive species. And there's a lot of them here. This part of the house isn't done yet, but they are getting in here and building nest on the inside of our house and they're pooping all over the side of my house i mean that's disgusting oh this stuff's so good a starling right here look at the color on that thing these are actually quite beautiful birds they just look like black birds up until you get really close to them but look at all those colors pretty boom got him That dove I just shot off my power line soared over to the neighbors to die. I'm not really gonna go bug the neighbors about a dead bird in their yard. Let me show you what gun I'm using here today. It's This is a uh, Crossman F4, 17 caliber pellet gun. Um, using this uh, Winchester 4x32 powered scope. And uh, well, this seems to be doing the job pretty good. Gotta wait for that truck or that tractor to pass. Boom, got him. 
freaking car pass right after I shoot. <laughs> All right, I've been walking around for a while trying to find this guy. And uh, about halfway through my pasture. So shot him in that tree. Found him way over here. But there he is. Another one gone. Okay, guys. A pigeon just landed behind the tree. You can't see it. But uh, I can't get a shot. Just gonna walk over to the tree and try to shoot it from the tree. Yeah. What a great shot. Oh, it is dead. Look at that. That is beautiful. Look at that thing. Guys, this is actually my first pigeon I ever shot. I've shot a lot of doves, but I've never shot a pigeon. Beautiful. A great shot too. That was, it died instantly. Look at the beautiful color on that. It's got some green on its neck, got some purple. Wow, I am so excited. That is awesome. All right, guys. So this is actually a different day than when I started this video. When I started, I didn't really have many birds actually coming into the tree. I guess they didn't like it as much as I thought. But different day. Got another bird. And uh, my, my wife's out of town today. So, uh, you know, she's not here to cook food for me. So I got to gotta live off the land and uh, duck season's over so i gotta shoot something and if you guys thought this was kind of weird that i'm just shooting birds in my backyard i don't freaking care i had fun doing it it's not illegal these birds are destroying my house they're pooping on it but yeah make sure you subscribe and check out my other content i'm just gonna cut the video now because i'm just gonna go cook this thing up for dinner